Do you consider yourself a sucker when dealing with women? If the answer is yes, watch this video until the end because today I will teach you how to never feel that way again. Welcome. This is Charm Mastery, the channel that teaches you how to intelligently conquer women. And if you like this idea, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel so you don't miss our upcoming videos. First, let's define what being a sucker means. Being a sucker is being naive. This type of man is easily fooled by a woman. He believes everything she says. He can't identify the signals a woman gives through her attitude. In addition to being naive, the sucker has an emotional weakness. He can't control his own impulses and act rationally. He is unable to identify what is happening and make the best decision for himself. Therefore, if you consider yourself a sucker in front of women, it's because you haven't learned to identify their signals and haven't developed your emotional maturity. A woman always gives signals of her personality. If she says something like, I'm not jealous, on the contrary, I'm very calm, but on the third date she starts inspecting your phone or gets upset if someone looks at you, then you should disregard what she said. And just as she gives demonstrations about her personality, she also shows signs of whether or not she is interested in you. And it's these signals that you often insist on ignoring. If a woman always responds to your messages in a short way, she shows that she's not interested in knowing more about you or prolonging the conversation. Sometimes she gives you only a little attention. But when it comes time to set up a date, she disappears, she runs away. Therefore, she may just be telling you things that bring you hope. She may say, wow, you're amazing. However, she's never willing to meet you. In some situations, the woman says right away that she's not interested in the guy. And he, in a sucker way, sends flowers, insists, crawls. Many men stay like this for days, months, and in some cases, even years. Now let's talk about your emotional weakness. It appears when something happens and shakes you, and you respond emotionally to it. A woman can keep you hanging, not respond to you, or be inconsistent in her responses. But it's up to you to take action. But when you're emotionally weak, you become impulsive. Developing emotional maturity is doing what is right and not what your emotions are asking for. And know that a respected man admired by women also feels these impulses. The difference is that at some point in his life, he realized that acting like that was a sign of disrespect to himself, so he decided to control them. Be sure that this doesn't happen overnight. You need to train your mind to do what's necessary, to do what will bring you benefits, and not what your heart is asking for at that moment. If you're emotionally involved with that woman who just steps on you, doesn't respond to you, and feel like sending the thousandth message, stop now and don't send it. Isn't it time for you to mature and better interpret reality? Know that it's in emotionally mature men that women see power. They know that if they start ignoring them, they will leave and never come back. And do you know how you become emotionally mature? By training every day. By doing what really needs to be done. If this video has clarified things for you and generated value in your life, please leave a like here. Don't forget to share it with your friends. See you in the next video.